I fucking dodged. Dick. Being a bit more aggressive, it seems. We got one of them. I think I want to get rid of Warrior. I mean, I said I wanted to get rid of Warrior. I didn't go for the Warrior. God, the noises they make. Rawr, rawr, rawr. Oh, I love when this happens. He's trapped on a tree! I win! Wow, that went super smooth. By comparison. Cutlass? What does a skeletal warrior have? Of course they have some bones. I mean, that's to be expected. Three fucking health potions! Hey, the undead should not be carrying those around. If fantasy games have taught me anything, it's that if an undead uses a health potion, or any sort of health restoring item, it should kill them. So the fact that that does not happen is a bit uh, misleading, to say, the, to say the least. I am really worried about that thing up there, though. It looks like a necromancer, of sorts. Yeah, I don't mind about saving so often. It means if I die, I don't get completely fucked. Last thing I would want to have happen is to rely on um, the autosaves. Because that really would suck. Right, time to fight the other one. Oh, is that just another warrior? I think it is. Yeah, it is, actually. I don't want to deal with that fucker. Oh! Oh shit, I thought the, the one with the axe was dead. Oh! Go on, dude. Uh, oh, God, okay. Try again. Go on. Hit me with your best shot. Hit me! Oh my god, my fucking timing is all over the place. And just generally really bad. Oh dear. Fuck. That's what I said, I don't even know why I dodged. All it took was one more. One more hit to kill it. Skeletal Warrior. And the other one. Oh, that had a torch. I think it was using the same as... Like, the same shield that I have. It wasn't using it, actually. Just had it on its person. Alright, use up some more of this meat. God, this game really does make you feel pretty damn good, actually. But once you manage to vanquish these things... You shit me. It's such a good feeling. I wouldn't say they're easy enemies. Pretty damn hard. It wasn't it. It worked. It worked. Hooray! Ooh, what? Oh my god, I got a leather helmet. Oh, Christmas has come early! I didn't even know you could get helmets. Shows how much of this I played. No, I'm kidding. Alright, helmet. Hey, my guy looks a bit less stupid. Can I break these? Nope. Indestructible vases, of course. What else? There better not be more shit in here. There's a bed! Oh yeah. A seaman's chest. Oh, it's not even one I have to... Got an amulet for ice protection. And a herring! And 116 gold. Or 146 gold. It was one or the other. Ah! Oh no! I think I may have attracted something I shouldn't have. Ah, oh, bollocks, I did. Alright, let's fucking tussle. Oh, no, no, no. You're an undead lord. Oh, ballsack. Do I dare? Yes, I do. This is a fucking bad idea. Oh, dear. Oh, great, I can parry. Aren't you clever? We both fucking just slashed past one another. I did not think there'd be another person hit in that building. Sucked. Great. 
I need literally two hits. Two, two. Two of my mega strikes. Oh dear. Ah. No, oh God. This is just very bad. Yeah, wait there, fuckface. I'm so glad the enemies just stand around. I'm using two of these, don't care. I should have just gone more aggressive. We win! Oh my god, I hated that so much. We got another Vassal Ring! Oh my god, if I need to get the Vassal Rings from Undead Lords. I think I know where at least one more is. Actually, no, I probably know where at least two more are. One's right near the bandits camp. Because there's a bunch of undead there. Like, just at the top of the hill before you get toward the bandits camp, there's a bunch of skeletons. Um, I tried fighting them before and I got insta-killed. Which is weird. Or maybe I just had really low health. I'm not entirely sure. Regardless. Yeah, that, that was one. Um, I'm trying to think of the... The other one was at the bottom of a hill. But I can't remember how I got to towards that. It was last session. But yeah, I, I don't remember how I get over there. Yeah, I do. It was right next to the bandit camp. When you've got the hill that goes up to the bandit camp, instead, I went to the left. And it led down a hill and to some ruins that was occupied by undead enemies. Sure, not too bad really. So if I went there, chances are, I'd probably find another vassal ring. There's six of the fucking things though. It's the only issue. And also before I do anything... No! Wait, are you just wolves? Or are you black? Black, black wolves. You're a wolf. Oh, you're fine. See, it's the black wolves that scare me. Ugh. Yeah, because they actually fuck me up. Wolves don't. So glad durability don't doesn't exist. Yeah, if it did, God, things would suck more. Maybe I should have slept till noon. Hmm. That's what I'm realising. Never mind. How did that not die? How did that not die? How is it still not dead? Oh my god. Fucking fighting on hills sucks. It just results in that happening. The enemy's able to get a clear shot at your nuts. Constantly. Oh, bloody hell. Not what I want. No thanks. Not interested in what you're selling. Not at all. Right, well. I know there's those over there, and I think they are black wolves. I mean, if you look at their coat, um... They definitely look like one. Yeah, they are. I'll just take the mushroom and go. I can fight them when I'm actually able to. I need armor that's like double as effective as my current. My current blocks 10 of everything. So blunt, piercing, and is it sharp? What the heck is it? Blade. Blade, blunt, piercing. So it's plus 10 protection on all of those. And then my shield gives me three against blunt and blade. And then the helmet gives me plus one on everything, I think. No, it doesn't. I think the helmet is just on blade and blunt. The shield is plus three on everything. Okay. Not too shabby, really. I'm really tempted to go for the vassal rings, then. Yeah, I just think it'd be quite fun to go after. I don't think I'll be able to reach all six, but I'll be able to get maybe able to get to four. I should be able to get to three. Yeah, it's just all a matter of... It's not really learning how the skeletons work, because they act as a human would. So their attack patterns are no different than a human's. The problem is the amount of bloody damage they do. Yeah. I still need to go to Harbour City too. Didn't really expect to spend so much time 
you know, quite literally just exploring the world. But it's surprisingly fun. You know, just be left to your own devices. But the most, like, the coolest thing is just exploring the world and finding the places that you actually can't go to. Technically, you can go to them, it's just a bad idea, because you can, you'll get messed up. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure one of those is going to be the ruin that's occupied by nothing but skeletons. Yeah, I'm always up, to a, up for a challenge. Oh God, I left the bandit camp to come over this way. To get to Harbour City, <laughs> I'm going all the way back. Hmm. I mean, I've done what I wanted. Yeah, because I, I wanted to figure out what the cave... Oh, that's not a berry. Oh. No, I wanted to know what the cave behind the novice's farm led to. And now I know. It led to the place I was actually going to. The East Coast is what I think it's called. Right, where I want to go... That's the temple. I don't actually think I want to go back to... Um, the bandit camp because there's some more stuff around the back like around the, the back of the Don's temple that I really kind of want to explore and yeah they, they are they're really awesome for exploring the only issue is it's like I've got a main story to get on with but <laughs> I just can't bring myself to go through with it I just want to explore so much Right, is it just going to be an undead lord? It's just, howdy! I mean, I just see one of them. On the plus side, if I manage to kill them, that's another another free bed I can use. I'm really out my depth there, aren't I? Oh no, it's a skeleton warrior. Oh. Shit. I can't see! Oh, of course, you would have three fucking attacks. Dick. That's not where I wanted to dodge to. Ah, bollocks. I think I might just be a bit overconfident because I've just fought some skeletons and they weren't that bad. There's only two of these as well. What the hell is the problem? Shit. I'm just trying to get rid of the skeleton in front. Then I'll be happy. Fuck me. See, I never know if they're going to do more than one attack or not. They're really good at blocking, though. That's for sure. There's one. Now's the worst one to deal with. I fucking hate this. Oof. Okay. So glad that the game decided to re-target this dude. That would have sucked otherwise. Fuck, I thought I'd got him. Damn it. Come on, I just need one more power attack. Oh my god! No, 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 no. I'm so glad I pressed, pressed B. Whew! It was almost armor for, over for me. Christ almighty, we got him. Whoo, boy. What a pain. All it was using was a rusty sword. God, if it's actually using a good weapon, I would have been screwed. Yay! I don't know if that's all of them, though. I really fucking hope it is. I mean, there is... Is there a bed? Oh, I thought that was a bed. A grave. Oh, that's a grave. Rest ah. in peace. Hear that fucking noise. Mushroom. I get the feeling if there's gonna be something that's holding a vassal ring, it's gonna be like in that shack or whatever the hell that is. Oh, it's gonna come out of nowhere and kill me. Either or could happen. Oh yeah. What the hell is this? A 
Another tomb. Oh, nameless scoundrel. What a name. That didn't do it. Fuck. So it's gonna be da 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 da. Yes. Yeah. I got a wing. I also got a quite good potion too. I really want to. I really don't want to heal. But if there is another undead, then I am screwed. Sorry, it, just save instead. Right, okay. Now, if there's an undead, there's a very high likelihood that I will die on the first hit. Is this even a shack? No, it's just got some gold coins. And a small shield. Oh. Wait, rusty thing? A rusty two-handed sword! I'm gonna awaken the dead here. Like, what are you doing? Gold coins. Stone plate. Whoa, okay. Picking up the most random of things. Hmm. And on the plus side, I made it out alive. The downside is there's no bed. Although, to be fair, I do want to go to the bandit camp, so. Go there to heal. Two birds with one stone, then. Although, I am very curious. Oh, fuck, wolf. Ah, shit. I ran into something I shouldn't have. What the hell are they? Wolves or black wolves? You're a wolf. Shit. Fuck. My timing, man. That's what I'm after. Fucking wolves. Okay, good. Oh, that had me super spooked. Although, to be fair, it's because I thought it was a skeleton. Ah, oh, bloody hell. I thought I'd explored the surrounding area. What the hell is this? Okay, a, a grave they were in the process of digging. Cool. I'm just glad that they weren't black wolf. Where the hell am I? Okay, it's just there's more sea vultures. There's just so much shit around. It's crazy. Green leaf. See, if I want to fight sea vultures, I'll just eat some meat on the way. I don't think they'll ever do all that much damage. Oh wait, the game just saved. Perfect. I mean, I know these aren't actual, like, the sea vultures. They're not the hungry ones. Oh dear. And there is four of them. Where am I? Fuck. I try to dodge. Yeah, sea vultures are a right pushover. I quite like them, really. Look at all this chicken. So much chicken, I got so much meat. I'm just rolling in food. Uh, now I know where I am. God, I'm stupid. Yeah, if I follow this round, it'll lead to the temple. At least I think. I'm really... biting off more than I can chew. Shit. Have a night, dude. Have a good night. And thanks for stopping by. Okay. Got rid of all those. Might as well eat some more meat. Last thing I want now is to die. The other game did save frequent, uh, recently, so it's not all bad. Fuck, now I'm gonna get mobbed by boss. Fuck off. I said fuck off. There we go. Woohoo! Fuck. Yeah, it was poorly timed on my part. It's all good though. Um, right, I, I still think this is going to lead over to the temple. Yeah, which, honestly, uncovering these kind of... I don't really want to call them secrets, because they're not. Ugh. Okay, 
it's not really a secret, but uncovering paths like this is so good. Oh no, it's just incredibly rewarding. One thing I am realizing though is when I kill those skeletons, it's not going to give me another va uh, vessel ring, sadly. And I was certain there was going to be one there. I do think I know where one of them is though. Yeah. Wait, so what's over here? I don't know actually. Wolves! Great! Not what I want to deal with. But up ahead I see more boars. Oh, shite knackers. If there's an ogre root... Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, this is... Okay, these are the balls I saw. Yeah. But I didn't go towards them because I thought they would kill me really quickly. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, God. Jesus. It fucking came up my ass. It really did. Came out of nowhere. God, I really am living life on the edge. Here's the plant. It's a healing root. Yeah, just in case. I'm gonna get like 40 fucking meat anyway, so... There's not really any sort of risk. You know, with eating the meat, I mean. Unless, you know, these actually manage to kill me, which... Fingers fucking crossed, they don't. Wow. Came close. How much health do I have? 22. Oh, wow. I'm at 10%. Oh, there we go. And now... We're directly at the side of the temple. Wow. That's pretty cool. Just the fact that this path... Leads all the way out... Into... The outskirts of the bandit camp. I don't know, I just find that to be really quite cool. Yeah. I think I can drop down here without taking much, or any damage, can't I? I about to say, if that did not let me out, that would have sucked. Yeah, just get completely stuck there. How fun that would have been. Oh wait, if I can do, I can do this now. Oh, I can actually cook shit. I can make fish soup. Or meat stew. I need onions and potatoes. That kind of blows. I don't want to trade iron ore. Do I ant? Would that be worth it? You're the sure, smithing level three. I want to forge a two-handed sword. You have to make the hammer dance on the glowing blade. Fast, precise strokes. When you hear that special song of the unfinished blade, you're doing it right. That's how you bring out the very best properties of the metal and create a true masterpiece. Hmm. Well, there's that. So, what have you got for trade? Yeah. What have you got? I don't know what I could do with getting rid of some of this shit. I've still got lots of... Well, I've got that, which is worth nothing. Sadly. Cutlass. I've got two sabers. Three hunting knives. These are just from the gnomes. And the skeletons, actually. The Executioner's Staff, and the Staff. I do wonder, like, whether or not Staffs are actually that good. Hmm. I'm gonna keep the Executioner's one, because that'll be interesting to use, I think. Get rid of those. One of my shields. I don't know what else I have. I've got an amulet, but... Could be quite nice to use. Ice protection, though, it just seems a bit weird. Got three shovels, two smith hammers, two picks. So I don't think the tools break. I'm pretty sure they don't. Oh, that's a tool bag. 17 of those. 10 teeth. Nine wolf hides. Honestly, like being able to skin animals gets you quite a lot of money from them. Like what I paid, actually, no, not quite. Well, so what I paid him to teach me smithing level 3, I've nearly earned back. I mean, to be fair, I have nearly earned it back.
Uh, okay. We don't need to learn anything else from him. Also, what do you mean? It's not available. Uh, noon. Because if that's the case, I might have to look into ways of making that global. Which, to be fair, is what I assumed it was, but that might not be the case. My apologies. Where's Craig? There he is. I think I want to get... Um... Combat, yeah, combat training. I want to improve my fighting skills. Level 2. And 10 learning points. Fucking hell. Teach me sword fighting. Right. I'm going to tell you how to counter parry. If you're taking flurries of blows, you need to knock your opponent's weapon aside. Do this. He's unprotected, so you must attack. It's not easy to do. You need a feel for the right moment to parry and attack. Practice it, and it will help you. But... Remember, it only works if you're being attacked. And if your opponent tries to parry, you won't get a chance to do it. Okay. I'm gonna get sword level three as well. Teach me sword fighting. You attack your opponent from the front, right? You'll need to do more than that. Such as what? Try attacking from the side. Mix it up to surprise your opponent, and you can use the momentum of a lateral blow to carry out a second stroke. Use your whole body and you'll do more damage. That was it. Lateral strikes. I think I'm good. Uh, 30 learning points is what I have. So, you can perform lateral blows. Counter parries can injure your opponents. Hmm. I think he teaches me axe. You teach me crossbow. Hmm. That's bizarre. I'll look into it. But yeah, I, w I was under the impression that it was always... Oh, that it was all global. Who? That guy has a stick. I don't trust this. Not particularly. Mm. It might be all right. Brandon. I need some rest. Oh, he's using a club. No wonder. I thought it was a warrior of the order. Super worried. Worried. Hmm. Right, so my only my other idea, I should have used the fire. Actually, wait, I think there's one down here. I think so. Whee! I thought he just kind of like bounces. Is there a fire down here? I'm certain there was. Mm. I mean, to be fair, I have to go a bit further down. Right. There! Yeah, okay, there is. Cool. Now that means I can actually make a bunch of meat. Chicken and... Meat stuffed bread. Sadly can't make that. I can make the herring, which is honestly kind of pointless. It gives you five health. Ooh. I think that's good. <laughs> it might actually be to do with how I have it set up. Honestly, because to be fair, something stuff like that is not I've it's not something I've ever really messed about with. So I might have made it so that it will only accept my own currency, which could I think it's something you can change. I'll just have to do some research. But no worries. I appreciate the fact that you want to donate though. 
Um. Right, I know I saw skeletons. At least I think I did. Yeah, I did. Right, okay. This is where it's gonna get shitty. Hmm. There we are. So briefly press that when your opponent attacks. Press A while Oh! That's a lateral blow. Oh! Oh my god. These have a lot more health. Oh my god, that's cool. There's one right by fucking eye me. Oh, I can see his miss. There. Keep forgetting the misses are like two-handed weapons. It's quite weird seeing them that way. Oh, uh, come on. That roll blows are pretty damn useful. Holy crap. 100 XP. And I killed them both. Skull splitter. Not a water barrel. Get out of here. Don't need to use that. Oh, there's the other one. Rusty two-handed sword. Perfect. Three health potions. The fact they're carrying that many on them is super useful. It takes about three health potions to get back to full health, so... Pretty cool. Harlong sword. I don't think I've ever heard of that, to be honest. Is that a good thing? <laughs> that it reminds you of that, or a bad thing? Oh, great! Not where I want to be. Okay. Right. I see at least two more skeletons in this first area. Oh no, I don't. I did see another one. Oh, he's down there now. Okay. Thankfully, the way skeletons work is they actually come running to you straight away. I do not want to go flying off the edge. I'm honestly quite worried. Oh, there we go. Did I lose? Oh no. I thought I lost the body. Woodcutter's axe. Not too shabby. Okay, lateral blows are awesome. I don't know, they just seem to work a lot, a lot better. Don't think I'm incredible at the combat, suddenly, but definitely seems to be working better. That's for sure. I did wonder if the combat ever got, like, jazzed up. Are there any steps? Look at him, targeting me. Shit, I hope that didn't uh, get the attention of all the others. Oh! I just keep switching between left and right. Oh! 